Hey YouTubers, I just wanted to create this short uh, video for you guys to explain how I added LED lighting to my Arians Deluxe 28 snowblower. Um, so as you can see, I actually purchased these on eBay, but these are 18 watt LED bulbs. Um, I mounted them on the uh, on top of the auger here, and you can see I routed the wiring around left side of the snowblower um, which goes up the handlebars here and underneath the uh, all the controls here I've added a switch which is right here um, which controls my lighting so I can have it on or off uh, under here or actually let me go to the right side here so this is where my wires are uh, these ran to the halogen bulb that came with the snowblower which does not put out very good lighting um, so I decided that I wanted to add LED lighting um, out of here there was a red and black or I'm sorry excuse me a yellow and black wire and I had to convert that over to uh, DC voltage that is AC voltage that comes out of the engine there um, and to do that I had to purchase a bridge rectifier and I also purchased a couple of capacitors and anybody that's curious or wants to add LED lighting to their snowblower I would highly recommend checking out um, the uh, snowblower forum I um, let's see it is I think it's snowblowerforum.com but there's uh, somebody that made a post on there by the username of SuperEdge88 and he kind of describes the process of adding the lighting and I definitely couldn't have done this project without uh, without his post, without his help so um, but I did want to post my success story here for you guys so you could see how it was done on my snowblower um, under under the uh, control unit here <clears throat> I don't know if you can see I'm going to use my lighting so let's see, so that's my bridge rectifier. I labeled it with all the uh, DC negative, AC positive, um, DC positive is kitty cornered from that. So basically I have my AC voltage running to the AC positive there. I placed a fuse in between. Uh, I don't know if you can see it, let me see. So the fuse is right there, but basically that yellow wire that ran for my engine, I uh, threw an inline fuse in there with the 5 amp fuse and then connected that to my bridge rectifier that you can see in the picture here. <clears throat> From the bridge rectifier I ran the, uh, the positive and the, and the negative. In between that I, ran, uh, I, I, put, I placed some uh, capacitors, two capacitors. Again, these are on the snowblower forum, <clears throat> but they were uh, they were added in between the bridge rectifier uh, from the DC out to my switch here. Uh, from the switch, I have obviously the positive and negative running to my LED lights. And again, as I uh, showed you earlier, that runs down the uh, the handlebars here to the left and then over to my lights. Um, the LED lighting I had to drill a couple of holes obviously to place the lights pretty easy to do. Um, let's see what else I can tell you guys. I purchased this uh, wire loom at O'Reilly's and then I have these uh, these little stickies. Um, this helps with zip tying the line to to my snowblower so there we go so there's the there's the lighting let's check it out in action so I'm gonna go ahead <clears throat> turn on the power to the snowblower and turn on the gas here let's throw the choke on and oh, okay. let's prime it a couple times there we go. All right, now it's running. 
So my switch is turned off right now. I'm gonna go ahead and take the choke off and increase the power to throttle the pole. Turn on my switch. There we go. There we go, there's my lighting. It's a pretty good light. I'm gonna go ahead and turn off these lights here. So you can get an idea of the lighting here. Okay, let me uh, get the lights back on in my garage. There we go. So again, that's the uh, that's a demonstration of the the lighting here on my Arians Deluxe 28. Um, I highly recommend it. It puts off a lot better light than the stock halogen bulb. Um, it's fairly easy to do. It's fairly inexpensive. I think in total I spent under a hundred dollars on this, so not too bad. Um, if you guys have any questions, let me know. I'm going to include some pictures of the uh, the unit here as well as the uh, the wiring, and hopefully that will help anybody out there who wants to try this with the, with their uh, snowblower as well. Um, I'm trying to think if there's anything else I can mention here. I think that is about it. So, again. Thank you for watching, and uh, hopefully this will help some of you guys out there. All right, thanks.